Hey everybody, Mark Callahan, Mr. Saltwater Tank, coming to you to let you know that the Australia portion of my 2018 VIP trip is completely sold out. If you want to see some world-class diving, world-class snorkeling, pick your own fishing coral, and do a lot of relaxing, don't worry, I still got you covered because the Fiji portion of my trip still has slots available. Now before I show you the video on what the Fiji portion is about, keep this in mind. There are discounts available for people who book by February 1st. So if you want to go to Fiji, grab your slot and grab the discounts before they're gone. We'll start the trip at Walt Smith Fiji where you'll see lots of fish and coral eye candy. You can pick your own fish and coral for your tank back home and once you're done shopping, we'll hop on the plane and enjoy in-flight entertainment of untouched coral reefs. After a short boat ride, we'll hit the sandy beaches of our private island that's going to be ours for the next six days. There is world-class diving within a 10-minute boat ride of the resort, so if you want to go diving, you're not going to be as stuck on a boat all day. And if you're a snorkeler, the reefs are right offshore. If you're a diver or you're a snorkeler, the aquatic viewing is mind-blowing. The first time I went to Fiji and got in the water, it was information overload. I'd never seen so many fish and so many coral right in front of my eyes. This trip is geared for divers, snorkelers, and your traveling companion that might not be in the saltwater tanks. An on-site spa will pamper you and your traveling companion with massages and other treatments. And if you want to stretch out your legs, there's hiking on the island as well. Waterfall tours are nearby, and for the ultimate romantic getaway, spend half a day in seclusion at your own private lagoon. You can make this trip as intense or as low-key as you like, as there's plenty of activities, and there's beach hammocks available as well. Here's what past trip participants have to say about Fiji. What advice would I have for someone who's not a diver but considers coming on a trip? Definitely come on the trip. Do not let the fact that you're not a diver hinder you from experiencing Fiji, experiencing amazing people that you would meet here in Fiji, and also sharing with, uh, with new friends that you get to make. The advice I'd have for someone that's uh, considering coming on the trip is, is just to do it. Um, our decision was a, a spontaneous decision. We didn't figure out all the details. Um, we just did it and the details all fell in place. A once in a lifetime type trip with amazing diving, amazing people, the staff and uh, environment is just incredible. It's, it's, it's uh, gonna be really hard to leave to go home. For me, the fantastic thing about coming to Fiji and doing all the diving was seeing species that I've only seen in books before. So to actually come face to face with these animals for the first time, I got a real kick out of that. I always do when I get to see something different. I've been to Fiji three times and I've never been disappointed. Now space is limited and remember those discounts are all available for people who book by February 1st. So grab your slot, grab your discounts and I'll see you in Fiji in the fall of 2018.